Das ist German Technology. Ich liebe Deutschland. What's up? We've got the Jeep Meridian on Power Drift today and I would say about time because every time I saw one on the streets, it looked pretty but I had this question, does it tick all the seven boxes of being a seven-seater family as well? It's not just you, Rohan, a lot of our viewers on our channel, they have the exact same question, can the Meridian take the spot of the Fortuner, the older Fortuner, for what it used to offer in that price bracket because remember this is a lot lesser than the Fortuner. My time has arrived, I can't hesitate. So the endeavor today is going to be to find out the answer to your question and my question. And it's going to be a special story because today is a special day, it's a Sunday, many things special. I've gotten a new phone here by the way after three long years. I hear the congratulations, thank you very much folks. And I've got a great pair of new lenses, new specs. These are called size drive safe lenses. Uh, by the way, the videos that we shoot on power drift uh, are shot on size lenses, they're really good. I want to try these out and if you want to try these out, the link to buy one will be in the description below. Where are we going? What? I thought you would know that. No, of course not. Your phone is connected? It is. Hey Google. Yep. Windmills. Windmills. Okay. Windmills near us. Come Shetia. It's a right turn from here. So there is a, a... Is there a road? That is no road. That is no road, right? Good for us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we are driving the Jeep. Very dear. I am. You are not. On country roads like these, when you are on them in a true blue seven-seater SUV like the Jeep Meridian, it is then that you'll truly realize the importance, the significance and the charm of an SUV like this. I mean, right now, I'm feeling like I'm the king of the road. No kidding. Not a road that we know. Uh, we are discovering it as we go. And for example, this. But yeah, look at him. He was reversing, and now but now he sees the meridian in his mirror, and he decides not oh, to. Benefits of a big SUV. Big SUV. Oh look, the windmills. We got to figure out a way of getting there. That should be easy. All right, let's go. Alright, let's make it look easy now. <laughs> pedigree of a Jeep is always set to be good. Yes. That's how we have landed up being on this journey. Out here, the top delivery is just the way you want it when you're off-roading. It's there, all of those Newton meters, they, it's, it's, it's available, but it's not in a way that it spins the tire and you know, it destroys the surface below. Also, it gets this inbuilt four-wheel system that is very smart. The overhangings, you know, the short overhangings and the, the ground clearance, everything is just designed in a way that the belly does not touch. Because once the belly touch, then the system, the mechanicals have to work a lot harder to get it out. So traditionally, ladder frame platforms, they feel indestructible when you're driving on trains like these. Uh, because you can just drive them at the speeds that you desire and they'll take it. Monocoque, yeah. the system, the powertrain and the, the brains of it all has to do a lot more thinking. Land Rovers have used monocoques for the longest time and made some of the best off-roading off machines. machines. Yeah. It's a 9-speed automatic transmission. It does a great job out on the highway. Save yeah. a lot of fuel. Yeah, I'm munching miles and cruising yeah. along on the yeah. highway. But here, but here it feels like it's 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 like a four speed, you know, it's holding the gears, it's giving me power when I need it. Yeah. The first story we did with size drive safe lenses was uh, which one? Your Volvo? The Volvo XC40. XC40? Yeah. 
and the second story was uh, mostly C300B. Right. This story is happening, which is the Jeep Meridian one, and then there's also an electric vehicle coming up. Okay, let's spin the beans. It's a mini. So do check out these four stories that we have done with support from Drive Safe Lenses. I think the experience of wearing these lenses when out uh, on these drives has been a fantastic one. Okay. And so I was wondering, thinking, how is how are uh, spectacles really going to be making a difference to my drive? But there's a lot of uh, biology and a lot of theory that goes behind making uh, technology like this because it takes time for your eyes to focus and refocus. So here, when you're looking at an obstacle, an off-road obstacle, and the sun is glaring into your eyes, mm -hmm. and you want to be looking elsewhere now for the forward or to the right here for the clearance, uh, all this focus and refocus of eyes, uh, size in their brochure mentioned that uh, they help with these situations also. Your pupils are not the same size throughout the day. There again the glasses are going to do the heavy lifting for good vision so that the stress on the eyes is less. Size is ja ein deutscher Name und uh, die Technologie kommt auch aus Deutschland. When you're having great automotive fun, it's actually a great idea to be filled with gratitude. And so, thank you, Jeep, for sending us a Jeep Meridian here for more than a couple of days. Windmills, a lot of windmills. Okay, and we're in a great view now. Should we, should we stop here for a while? I think we should. Oh, it's very beautiful. Yeah, we yeah. are. You should name this something. Huh? This a dirty, dirty machine? No, this is dirty because it's a lifestyle enabler. Seven-seater off-roading SUV. The SUV sounds like it. No, I, I meant Ich liebe Deutschland. No, I, I meant we should name this what we're doing. Uh, you know, going to destinations, new destinations, driving to new destinations, unexplored. Falling in love with cars. Wow. Are you ready for the show?